if you're building a crystal set, then the best choice of headphones are something like these. High impedance, 2000 to 4000 ohm, very sensitive, but also very old, and they may be hard to obtain. Another possibility is a crystal earpiece like this. However, quality varies and they can be uncomfortable and you might not get the best reception on them. Here's an alternative. I bought a cheap stethoscope off eBay, only cost a few dollars, and removed the sensor element. Then, at the end of the tube, I just glued to a piezo transducer. Not a piezo buzzer, but a piezo transducer. While a transducer held up to your ear by itself isn't very good, if you've got the coupling going into your ear canal, which is what the stethoscope does, then you'll get good reception. Connecting to the transducer is a resistor in parallel. This is 68K, but its value isn't that critical. 47K or 100K, maybe even a bit more either side would be okay. That resistor provides a DC path, and that's required to get full volume. Didn't take very long. The most time was waiting for the glue to dry. But with this setup, I can get reception on my crystal set just as good as with the high impedance headphones. So if you're looking at a way to hear signals from a crystal set without an external audio amplifier, then just try this trick with a cheap stethoscope and a piezo transducer, and you might be surprised at how good the results you get. Enjoy these videos? Want to start in amateur radio? Well, check out my books. Ham Radio Get Started for USA readers and the Australian Ham Radio Handbook for those in Australia. For more information, visit my website vk3ye.com or search their titles on Amazon.